Yeah. Everybody ready? This is uh, Deputy Chief Mike French with uh, Battalion 1 with the Arlington Fire Department. Can you tell us out here today? Uh, yes, at uh, 1229 a.m. this morning, uh, the Arlington Fire Department dispatch uh, alarm office was notified by Six Flags Security uh, that they had some people stuck on a roller coaster. Uh, we arrived on scene and, uh, five is and, on the ladder. and found out that there was eight patients or eight passengers rather uh, on the uh, Joker roller coaster. And so we initiated a, a rescue with two aerial trucks to uh, get the uh, passengers down to the ground. Any complications you guys ran into? I know it was raining out there. Yeah, at, at the time the roller coaster stuck, uh, uh, there's a, a severe storm, uh, severe thunderstorm moving through the Arlington area. I don't know how much, if that, how much that played a role uh, in the roller coaster uh, doing what it did. Uh, but uh, it didn't stop us. We went ahead and set our aerials, and uh, we were able to start the, the rescue as soon as we got here. Talk about the people. Were they uh, scared, nervous? Uh, still assessing that. It was, uh, t uh, I believe, uh, today was senior night or senior day for Six Flags. So it's my understanding that there's uh, seniors, high school seniors from all over the state uh, that came to Six Flags tonight. The park is open till 5 a.m. this morning. So uh, all eight passengers on the roller coaster uh, is uh, my understanding that they were uh, uh, young people, teenagers uh, that were on the ride.